Hey y'all, welcome into the channel. I hope everyone is having an amazing day. You guys, hold on one second. Okay, so this person that we're going to do this reading about, mm -hmm, they're completely enamored by you. Um, there's complete adoration, okay? Someone adores you. I'm hearing that song by Miley Cyrus, Adore You, okay? I'm hearing that. This person adores you. Like, you may tell this person you love them, but like at the end of the day, this person loves you more, like... This person loves you more. This person is completely in love with you. Not in lust. This is lust. It's like it's been decided, okay? Thank you, angels and spirit guides. This person, they love you. They don't lust you. They don't want to play with you. This person is in love. I'm hearing head over heels. I'm hearing inspired by you. I'm hearing challenged by you. So I feel like you push this person or you've encouraged someone to um, be better, to show up fully, or you encourage them to have inner strength or inner power. Okay. I'm hearing transolving illusion. Okay. There's something that you um, has call, have caused this person to see through something that could have been messy. Okay. We have legend at the bottom of the deck. Um, good morning, legend. The making of history. All right. Receive Expected, all right. I feel like this is going to be called the making of history. What do we got? I am happy. Okay. Good morning. There's peace here. Happy Friday. It says it's okay to rest when you need to. Maybe this weekend you got a lot of rest. Okay. Or you got caught up in some, on some rest. All right. Or some um, TLC. Okay. Much needed. I'm hearing. All right which is tender love and care, okay? We got morning, chosen, and committed. Y'all, why me and my honey bun, we done went and bought some matching shirts. Y'all, I got to go get this shirt. I got to go get it. Let me show you this shirt. Hold up, hold up, I'm gonna show you. It says, not in my time, but in divine timing, which is on time, every time. I am patient, making my ancestors proud, okay? So whatever it is you're out here doing, you, you've gotten the approval of your ancestors, You've gotten the recognition of your ancestors and your ancestors are proud of you, okay? Um, you've landed, all right? You've landed, okay? There's a celebration here, all right? There's freedom. I'm hearing liberation, okay? Um, so we got that lotus flower energy popping through. The lotus energy showed up in one of the two readings, either I'm just a soul um, or something about a soul, okay? And then what's good... I mean, what's understood don't have to be explained, okay? One of those two readings, the Lotus popped up. If you saw that, um, those readings, then you already saw that confirmation or that synchronicity. But anyway, good morning, prepared, love and light, okay? Um, there's something that you, it's like you're ready or this person's ready. I feel like this person's ready. They're committed. They're dedicated, okay? This is the energy of being engaged, like engaged in the game, okay? This person's an, a player that's actually ready like they're ready for the ball to come in their court okay 317 on the clock excuse me so i feel like this person was waiting on someone like you because we got patient prepared committed and happy this person's they're happy it's like they're happy. Something coffee about coffee could be significant, okay? Uh, a coffee, a, a conversation over coffee, all right? But it's like this person is committed to healing. They could have been committed to their healing. Maybe you caused this person to be committed to their healing. This person is like, this is a peaceful connection. This I can do. This I can invest in. This is where I want to be. Donnell Jones vibes, where I want to be. Okay. Uh-oh, I just left my baby girl I'm missing. Said I wouldn't be coming home. I'd rather be alone. She doesn't fully understand me. And I'd rather leave than to cheat. Okay, so it's like this man... They not the type that's going to cheat on you. They're like, look, if anything goes down, I'm going to leave your ass before I cheat on you. I ain't mad at them because that's a level of respect, honestly. That means this person has a certain respect for you. They like, look, I'm not going to dog you out. I'm not going to treat you like others did. You, 455 on the clock, I'm changing for you. 
this person is changing for you. You inspired them. Y'all wait. I'll be right back. I want to go get the shirt. Hold on. Look, y'all. Isn't that cute? That's cute, huh? I love them. We both got one and we got another one. Let me show y'all this other one. Hold on, y'all. Y'all probably like, girl, we didn't come here for that. But maybe this is something you and your boo about to do. Like maybe y'all are about to like start to, I don't know. Someone here is starting a clothing line for their, like a, a you like, uh, I don't know. I'm getting like, you could be getting ready to start like a, a, a t-shirt line, a clothing line. Okay. Um, where it's, ba it's like, it's based off, not based off of, but it talks about, it talks about your, or, or is a reflection of your, um, coupleness or your togetherness. Okay. Or like maybe you and your couple, your man, you know, you want to start matching or wearing stuff like, I don't know. But the fact that this person even is willing to do that, you know what I'm saying? Like, wow. You know? It shows that this person is not embarrassed by you. Um, they don't have a problem showing you off. This person wants to wants people to know that you're with them, that you guys are an item, that you're a team, a unit, that you're together. So there's no shame there. There's no hide. Nothing's hidden. Okay. This is good energy. Look, it says Missy Elliott, drip demeanor. Okay. So that's one. All right. We got no one going to love you like I'm going to love you. So this person is like... They like your touch. They feel like you are a queen. You own the crown as it relates to the touch or I feel sensuality. Like I feel like a sensualness. 651 on the clock. Okay. Someone's birthday could be June 7th. I'm sorry. June 6th. Okay. I feel like they feel justice with you. So no one going to love you like I'm going to love you. They're like, uh, mm, mm, mm. hold on y'all. Mm. Mm. oh they're like okay they've been through some things please don't hold that against me okay so this person's background isn't squeaky clean but neither is yours okay so it's like you guys have but it actually has been you've used it they're saying you've transmuted it and used it as a tool so what you've done is everything from your past the broken hearts the failed relationships um the experiences good or bad it's like you've been able to transmute that energy to where now that you know what you don't want you can show up better for what you do want this person has learned a lot from their past. It ain't been squeaky clean and they ain't been perfect, but neither have you. So we have, they, they out here like, what can be higher than this? What can be higher than this love, than this connection? This is something that's cosmic. This is something that's, it's, it's bigger than me. It's divine. Okay. Yeah. Temperance energy. They're like, our ancestors brought us together. The cosmos brought us together. This union you're in, it makes your ancestors proud. They like, yeah. I don't know if this is somebody's grandmother. This is a woman. This could be a mother, a grandmother, an auntie, or a sister, a cousin, or a friend that is in heaven. And they are like looking down over their over this relationship. I feel like because they've worked together to like get this relationship to come together. Maybe this relationship was hard to come by. Maybe this is, it's been hard to cut, like hard. I feel like this person's like, I've been searching for somebody like you. You're rare. You're hard to come across. I, I identify, I see and recognize the, the difference in you. You have an empire state of mind. 8.53 on the clock. There's abundance with you. There's love and light with you. You ooze positivity or you ooze healing energy something about turquoise is very significant okay so it has oh if they were dealing with anybody um the way they respect you okay because this is over here with that energy they like look she's out of my life okay um and also when you're not around this person misses your energy oh my god i said because you're rare and look at this you're rare this person sees you as completely rare. This person may study you, okay? They may may have looked into you or they may be finding out more information about you. But the more 944 on the clock that they find out about you, they cancel the notion, the idea of entertaining anyone else. That's what I'm hearing. They're like, show me what you got. 
Jay-Z energy, okay? The Sagittarius could be significant. So let's see what signs you may see that will let you know, like, oh, this person, oh, they for real, for real, okay? They, they ain't going nowhere. I'm hearing they're staying 10 toes down. Oh, them cards just going to flip out of there like that? Okay, they want to be seen. I wish I could have saw that on camera. Did you see it on camera? You might have. We have the duck. The duck symbolizes clarity, family, love, vigilance, intuition, nurturing, protection, feelings, self-expression, balance, adaptation, grace, and strength. So the duck symbolism is closely connected to water symbolism, which is about mystery, magic, and inspiration. But water is also about them emotions, okay? Water's also about them emotions. So I feel like you're going to see that this person is emotionally invested. They're going to clarify any questions you have as it relates to like family, uh, financial responsibility, obligations, okay? This person's going to find a balance within themselves to feel confident enough to express whatever they like. I feel like they already are. This person already expresses to you uh, 11, 13 on the clock that they, they desire security and stability from you, that that's what they that that's what they're here for. OK, they're telling me um, to reference think like a man, act like a lady. That's Steve Harvey book. OK, and they're talking about the part um, where a man is either a fisher or or and if and he is okay but he's either fishing for a keeper or he's fishing for something to throw back okay and so like i feel like he was this person uh was fishing for a keeper okay this felt this this person whether masculine or feminine they're under they're under the energy of a keeper like this person's here for the long haul it said longevity wherever i saw that at where did i see longevity I don't know. But anyway, maybe that's just what I wanted to say or what I heard or feel. But either way, I feel like longevity, maybe it was in the other reading. Either way, they ain't going nowhere. Okay. Um, li lilac symbolism. It says there are many meanings that lilacs have. Okay. Lilac is a flower. For those of you that don't know, it's a purple flower. Okay. Nurturing your mind. You nurture the body. Remember that. That's significant for those other two readings. It's like, anyway. Oh my God, I saw this card in my third eye. Oh wow. Okay. Something about a unicorn energy. Okay. Um, there are many meanings that lilacs have. Okay. And they symbolize spirituality. Okay. The blue lilacs symbolize happiness and tranquility. And the magenta ones, they uh, symbolize love and passion, okay? So, and the white ones, they symbolize purity and innocence, okay? I feel like this person sees you as very innocent, very pure, very nurturing. That's why they're willing to commit. They know that there's no one else that's going to love them the way you do. I feel like they haven't met a love like you before, 1326, okay? Um, 444 Energy. Spiritual meaning of Marinella. The Marinella has the numerology of the number seven. It says they try to analyze as many things as possible. Maybe this person has a lot of Libra in their chart or they're a thinking man or thinking woman. OK, this person analyzes a lot. All right. Um, as possible. OK, and not just that they I mean, not just that, but they also believe in spreading awareness about everything that they know. That's why I said this person don't have no problem speaking out, expressing themselves, telling you how they feel, telling you what they what they what their understanding of things are, because the whole reason they do that is so that you guys can kind of one, make sure you're on the same page. That's why I was like they study you. So this person studies you. Because they want to make sure you're on the same page. They want to make sure that you're a safe place or safe space for them to be with. Are you are you in it to win it? Are you in it for the long haul? Are you putting the I in win? Okay. Um, it's like that type of vibe. The meaning of the Marinella is also the name of the C. You have this person tapped into some emotions that they've never tapped into before. 
777 is here. They want to be a reflection. We copy that energy here. It's like they want to be a reflection of you. Emotionally, this person wants to, they want you to really emotionally connect. Like, they like, look, we gonna, like, this person's invested. So we have wheat spiritual meaning. Wheat has been seen as a symbol of fertility in life. Yeah, they so invested that they could be wanting to uh, create a child with you. Okay, there's like they like let's let's go ahead and uh, are you fertile? If you are, be careful. If you don't want to have a baby, because this person they are grateful for you. This person, um, mm, they think stands up strong. That thing stand up strong. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Woo! Okay, I don't know why I'm getting the Ace of Wands energy off of this card, but I am. Like, I don't know if they're hot for you or you're hot for this person, but it's like this person, you turn this person on. So the week provides nourishment, okay? Um, I feel like they see you as nourishment. You provide nourishment. You would be a good mother. You would be a good father. You would good be a good role model. You would be a good parental, like a good example a good role model like that you would be good to look up to it's like th there's this person they admire you in the beginning i talked about that song i adore you this person adores you the way this cat rubbing on that lady leg okay this person adores you they're grateful for you or your light or whatever it is you're bringing to the table this is also associated with abundance and prosperity. I feel like they feel like whatever they would create or grow with you or manifest or bring into fruition with you in a form of co-creation or creating or manifesting or whatever. It's like they feel like you would be an abundant choice. There's abundance with you. There's growth with you. There's prosperity with you. There's gain. There's multiplication. There's additions. There's more. Okay, they could see you as the Empress. I'm getting Empress vibes, okay? Mother, Cancer vibes. Because you're emotionally supportive of this person. I'm hearing that song because we are supportive in this moment. Some flowetry shit. Like, y'all's 17, 19. It's real, real, like, there's a lot of chemistry. Okay, lots of chemistry, a lot of passion, all right, a lot of fire, okay. Um, we have Paris spiritual meaning, delivery, delivery, delivery. Good morning, my love. Yeah, I feel like this person is very expressive as it relates to um, letting you know how they feel. So it says, when Paris spirit animal wings its way into your life, be on the lookout for fresh ideas and signals that indicate a new direction of your work, relationships, or spiritual pursuits. There's going to be for one or two of you that's in here, heavy emphasis on the spiritual pursuit, okay? Parrot often speaks, but I know this is a love reading, so we're going to keep it at the love, okay? The love buzz, okay? Y'all remember the love connection? Y'all remember that show? The love connection. I feel like you've made a love connection, okay? Worth waiting for. All right. There's an Aries, a Taurus significant, an Aquarius, and a Leo. Very significant here in this reading. So uh because the homework card came out with those four signs on it now you don't have to be those zodiac signs but i feel like some of you are those are your people that's your spouse that's who you're connecting with okay or you are that person or that's the empress and the and the and the emperor here and the same energy showing up together i feel like your emperor has shown up for you or this this uh empress is showing up for you okay um so the pair often often speaks through omens and signs that come repeatedly so you're about to receive like some signs how many deliveries is this one two three four five six you're going to receive six signs okay three to six because we got three eights all right um that something's abundant okay or this person views you as abundant well that's one confirmation 12 18 on the clock Okay, there's going to be a significant event. Um, I feel like in 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 Miami, 
revolving around uh, Chuck E. Cheese. I don't know what that's about. That's going to be some breaking news energy. Y'all got to go to the restroom. So we got to wrap this reading up, okay? Because I got the pee thing. All right. Anyway, sorry. TMI, but whatever. <laughs> okay. Um, this right here talks about the falcons, the falcon spiritual meaning. And it also talks about the will of fortune. And it also talks about a dragon spiritual meaning. And then it, which is, which is a symbol of passion. What does that say? Hold on, y'all. Fire and passion. There's definitely some fire energy. I told you a lot of fire. There's a lot of chemistry, a lot of passion. Okay. But it's not just the the, the chemistry or the passion. There's emotional movement here. This is like, yeah, 2022 on the clock. Like, I love your ass. Okay. Like, that's that vibe. Like, someone's like, yeah, no, I love you. Like, I love you. This person, they decided they love you. You're rare. You're unique. They love you talent alert there's that yellow light energy okay that i talked about in the i'm just a soul who's misunderstood okay or something like that however that oh Lil wayne song goes but anyway Lil wayne zodiac could be very significant isn't he a leo Nas is a leo there's leo energy here okay big cat family there's an eagle here. Someone searched their heart or they searched your heart. I feel like that's why they were studying you. They were trying to, they was like, is you who I think you are? Okay, my angel on earth. I'm hearing my angel. Mm, 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 mm. 21, 22. You're my angel. Okay, this person was like, you're my angel. The last sign on here or significance is the pelican spirit, which talks about humility, sacrifice, and it talks about generosity and unity, okay? So I feel like in the past, you and this person have made some sacrifices, okay, um, with homework. But it's like at the end of the day, that was the inner work that was necessary for you to go through. Whatever those inner challenges were, whatever those um, experiences were, they were they, you had to go through them to grow through them, okay? I'm hearing in my mind... I'll always be his lady. Heather Headley. Okay. Something about her zodiac sign could be very significant. Now, there could be an energy. Okay. Because I'm getting it this way as well. There could be an energy that's like, look, in my mind, I'll always be his lady. All right. Um, or it could be a masculine energy that is like, look, in my mind, um, she'll always be my lady. Okay. So there is someone that still wants you or your person or the both. Like you got somebody that still wants you and your person has somebody that still wants them. But it's like this, you know, they, I don't know what their story is, um, but I feel like that's what's being left behind with this full moon. We're done with that. Whatever that past energy is. Yeah, we, we doing this inner child work. We searching hearts. This person studied you long enough. You studied this person long enough. And it's like, yeah, we're moving forward. Okay. In, in security, in love. I'm hearing mood forever. Beyonce and Jay-Z. All right. It's like that type of vibe where it's like, nah, this I move forever. Okay. Forever and ever. <laughs> okay, we got nobody does it better. This is how they look, and they like, nah, we didn't we done went through the uh all the um sign ups. We we went through all the uh what do you do? You go and you try to give me the word, spirit. <laughs> I can't think of the word right. Audition. There it is. Thank you. 2331. Audition. They like, nah, we didn't auditioned enough, or we didn't played enough, or we didn't sat back, we've observed enough. Okay. Something about um an old school car could be very significant. Okay. And it's like, nah, nobody does it better. Like there's no one that does it better than you. Maybe y'all both feeling like this. Y'all looking over the the options. All right. You're like, yeah, nah. I, um, mm, yeah, I'm gonna make home happy. Happy wife, happy life. Or happy husband, you know, uh uh won't be I don't know, something slick. I still ain't came up with that saying. But anyway, um, so this person's like, oh, I think I like her. She might be psychic, okay? You could be psychic, okay, or your person is. Um, someone is is very connected to the most high, okay? Um, this afternoon you're gonna be experiencing some form of a transformation. OK, um, and you're going to see that something is golden or this person's like, look, living my life like it's golden. I feel like going forward, this person, this is you and this person. This is him. 
This is your masculine's energy. Listen to this song, and this is how they feel about you. Feminines, this is your energy, okay? I feel like this is how this person, either you're viewing yourself, or because if I'm looking at it, this is how I view myself. Living my life like it's golden. Living my life like it's golden. Living my life like it's golden, okay? Um, it's not about pleasing anyone else. It's only about pleasing yourself. But it's like, maybe that's what this person sees. They see how much self-love you have for yourself. You could be extremely intuitive, okay? Empathic or whatever. And they're like, dang, there's nobody that does it better than you. Maybe this person, like if you are spiritual, your person, they brag about your gift to others. Like when you're not around, they're like, man, yeah, my baby's spiritual as fuck, okay? Like they like that. They like, ooh, that turns, they do something for them. This person likes that. Okay, look, use this gospel. I feel like that's the ancestors like, yes. Okay, them same ancestors that's over here looking over this situation with the temperance energy patients. They like, yes, this is exactly right. Use that. Say that shit, girl. <laughs> All right. Now we got Nightcap, okay? We got the Mana by Bob, and we got, oh, top off the Maybag, okay? So I feel like you've blown this person's crown chakra. Um, something you've done, like you've really shown up or shown them um, a, a way about you or something about you that is unique um, and rare. Um, and I feel like they, they know that they found a gem. Okay. This person knows that you're an earth angel. They know that you're a gem. Top, top, coon, that's why they hate me. Okay. They know they're like, Ooh, this person's a top tycoon in their field, whatever it is they're doing. They're like, man, this person walks it like they talk it. So it's like, because you do with the giraffe energy right here as well, this person, they have a higher perspective. They have a better understanding that you and them are a part of something way bigger. And it's like, they, they are giving up whatever was holding them back, whether it be a mindset, a person, a place, or a thing, they've given it up because they want to connect fully with you, okay? So this has been your reading. This is what's going on with your love life. I hope that you enjoyed, okay? And if you did, go ahead and drop your girl a like on the way out. I'll see y'all next time. Peace out.